Hey, this is Pastor Mike from Cornerstone, and we are starting a brand new series this Sunday at Cornerstone called Social Faith. Now, we've been going through a crazy time these past few months, and one thing I've learned is I've seen it draw out the best in people. We've seen how the community has rallied around each other. We've seen how churches has con have continued reaching our community in the midst of a crisis. And, and social media has played a part in that, that we get to see some of the good things that are happening. But it also brings out some of the not so good, if we're honest. And one of the things I keep hearing from people is they're just frustrated with social media. Uh, how, you know, you, because you see things on there, you see drama, you see people arguing, you see, uh, you know, you see news that doesn't make sense all the time, and you see this person saying this and this person saying some, something completely different, and we're trying to make sense of all this. Here's what I want you to know. I believe the Bible gives us a framework for how we can navigate our friends and navigate our faith in a world uh, that's sometimes crazy. And I believe the Bible gives us guidelines on how we can use our voice to share our faith and to proclaim Christ and to keep our witness in a world that desperately needs to hear the message. And it means we're going to have to exercise some self-control. It means we're going to have to think before we post. <laughs> All right, There's a lot the Bible says about how we measure our words and how we think about the words we say. And, and I want to challenge us during this series. Let's go back to the Bible. And let's see how we can be a light to a community. Let's see how we can be that light that this world so desperately needs right now. And so instead of giving up on it, let's learn how to use it in a way that honors Christ. And that's really what this series is about. We invite you to join us here at Cornerstone. Uh, we started meeting back in person a few weeks ago, uh, and there's plenty of room here. We are spaced out, and so we've got our uh, seating spaced out. Uh, every other row, we've got room for you to spread out when you're here. Uh, we are still wearing masks because the mandate's still in, a, in effect, even though we're in phase three. But this is a, this is really just that we invite you to come back and join us. There's just something special about being in person together. But if you're not able to, then here's what I want you to do. One, I want you to watch online and I want you to invite your friends to watch as well. And maybe if you are around kind of a, a few people, invite them to come over to your house and watch with you. But make it a uh, make it a, a just a party to get together on Sunday morning and to, to worship together, uh, to get in God's Word together. Uh, we're excited about this series. We really uh, can't wait to see what God is going to do through this. And if you would, just help us to get the Word out and let's learn together what God's Word has in store for us. So thanks for joining in 9.15 or 11 a.m. on Sunday morning. Uh, tune in and join us or join us in person even better. So we, will, we look forward to seeing everyone back in, in person soon. But in the meantime, just God bless and stay safe.